for this morning draw in session 15 is Sweden playing China. Sweden plays China its first end. It's the penultimate stone, last of Skip Rocks for Sodu Ja, looking to take China out of trouble. Sweden currently lying three, sweeping this to get past the guard, but have they swept too much? Indeed they have. This one slipping way too deep to the back 12. Will allow Adin to play the draw to score four. A big team scrub to get there. But it is good enough. Four points for Sweden. A huge start. And in the second end, Sweden would be lying three. This time, though, China with the last on advantage. Drawing for one. A team sweep from China as well. But it's not enough. This stone pulling up short. It's a huge steal of three. Seven nothing game. And two more steals from Sweden. A nine nothing game brings us to the fifth end. So do ja looking for their first score. Will run back, come off their own, and will sit in the button to score one. And it's nine one after five. Coming back onto the ice after half time, sixth end. It's the uh, last one for Sodoja. Looking to set up for a steal. Chardardy and Juja Tao make this pretty perfect for their skipper. <laughs> Locks it right in there. A gridlock facing Nicholas Adin of Sweden. Can't do anything else than come down, tap it up. Just try and remove the back yellow to give up a steal of one. And that's exactly what he'll do. Still China trailing big. And a missed draw by Sodoja on his last leaves a full house for Sweden to draw to, just needing to hit anywhere in the rings for the single point. And Adin will do just that. It's a 10-2 final score, dominant win by Sweden. It's a very dominant performance against an informed China team. Yeah, we, we got a good start with the four there. We were playing a bit uh, risky, but uh, at the same time, we, we knew we were making a lot of shots. And uh, when we got that opportunity, he was heavy on his last draw. We got an open draw for four. I think it it feels really good. It's not game over, but it's really close to it. We we feel uh, totally in control, and they feel they have to go uh, hard for a hard for a deuce. And then we, we get a steal of three, and then it's definitely the game over. Was it the plan to go so aggressively? Yes. <laughs> So um, what next? What, what's going to happen the rest of the day? What, what, what have you got planned? Uh, we got back-to-back -back draws, so we are, we're going to go have some uh, quick food and then back as soon as we can to get a little bit of rest before the next game and then uh, uh, hopefully get uh, a nice evening. Uh, if we can win the next one, we're in a really good position, so uh, that will be a, a nice evening if we can do so, but we're going to focus on the next game. Well done, Nicholas.